the goddamnedest thing happened. I woke up into base, a few things had been changed, and I had a sudden, inexplicable need to rewrite the airlock code. Wonder if it means something. Okay, well, I've already made the chips in the housing, and now I have to get this thing to release the doors and everything. Which is sometimes difficult to do, because it can be a bitch. There we go. Now, I don't want this card anymore, but I'm going to keep the console, because um, the airlock code that I made doesn't monitor, doesn't have a way to tell me um, how much gas is in the, is in the room. But, these gas cards exist. So what I can do is I can use the gas sensor inside the airlock to show me the pressure. And that way, I don't need to use a, um, a diode or anything. Okay, now I need... Okay, this airlock uh, chip is going to go to be sold. Because it's a... It's a bad, evil thing with no mommy. There we go. We don't want the hydro housing. We want... Oh, I gotta, I gotta rename those housings first. So, this housing is going to be... I see... Airlock... Mode... Selector. And this one will be... Airlock... hardware. Kind of an esoteric naming there. Very, uh, DOS 6.0 and earlier, but we, we do what we can do. So we want the airlock hardware. We'll import what's on the chip, which is blank. Then I will go over here and I will load the airlock code for the hardware controller, which is here. Paste. This is still in some testing phases. Uh, airlock select mode. And then I will take the mode selector from over here. Copy and paste it in here. Oh, uh, and... Uh... Okay, that, yeah, that looks all right. Oh, and it looks like I already put in the bypass for the dial. Uh, I didn't, I couldn't remember if I already did that or not. Okay, so we're going to turn this one on, then this one on. Then we'll take out our screwing driver. We need door interior. Airlock interior. Airlock interior. This one is airlock exterior. Oh, that's the wrong one. So airlock interior. Airlock exterior. Ventilation device we need. Interior. And active vent interior, no exterior. Yep. And then this will be the mode selector. So we need I C M 
Oops, there we go. I see select. And that one's blank. And we need door interior again. Door exterior. Gas sensor. There's only one gas sensor, so that's fine. Gas sensor. And this is the debug dial, which we're not going to use. So this goes on first. Oh, that scared the shit out of me. Well, let's put the helmet on. Let's not put the helmet on. Let's open... Ah, I'm stuck. Oh no. Oh no. Light on. I need the suit. Give me the suit. Dick. Because it defaults to opening the outside, so that's going to be pretty horrific if that happens without a suit on. Not that I know how that feels. At least I shouldn't know how that feels, because I've never experienced something like that before. Okay, so... I've got that. I'm gonna put the mitt on. Oxygen critical. Light there we on. go. Put hardware back on. Cool. And I'm gonna put this back on. And unfortunately, I'm gonna use I'm gonna lose a little bit of internal gas because it defaults to outside, and for some reason, my brain didn't tell me to, you know, vent that first. But this is still the safest vent, is for it to vent uh, what's in here outside and not what's outside in there. So, oh, and this this blackguard is still here. I don't know why he's still here. Come, oh, no. Hi, Blackguard. While I'm out here, I've forgotten how much um, gas is in here, so this is pretty good. We've still got some O2 and NOS, but no volatiles. So I'm not sure if I put the volatiles in yet. And we've got plenty of stuff, so that's good. Okay, let's... Get back in here. What's happening? 101. Um. Excuse me. Cycle, please. Uh-oh. Uh oh. Oh no. See, this is why you have to test things. Because if you don't test things, um, they screw up. So the dial. Okay. Okay. What if I click that button? Oh, no. It's not changing the mode. Okay, there's nothing wrong with that one. Oh, I have, I did it, I said it wrong. Uh, airlock, internal, airlock, external, internal, external, okay. Okay, good. Okay, I just set that up wrong. Oh. Oh man, I should probably put in a clause in there 
to make sure that it's the proper um, uh, the proper hardware, but doing that will take more lines of code. And I don't really have a lot of lines of code to begin with. Oh yeah, and I can't do that because this is connected to that empty pipe there. And I can't really trick it to open. So, what I'm going to have to do because that because that pipe there doesn't have uh, any O2 in it or any capability of giving me any O2 I'm just going to do this filter low and then sooner or later it should realize that it is Not at the proper pressure. So we'll just bend this in here. And now it knows it's at the proper pressure. Okay. So, to prevent that from happening again, right now, at this stage, we will go to the mode select. We'll import the mode select. Hydration critical. And we'll tell it to explosively recompress for the interior door. We'll write that. There. Everything's copacetic now. Air tank critical. Now I have a working airlock. Cool. And I need water. And some food. And perfect. There we go. I have an airlock. That's not going to kill me. Today. It might kill me another day. That's a uh, always... Um, always a distinct possibility. So we don't need that anymore for now. And, okay, so this thing is still uh, not dealt with. And we have put our gases in here. So we got some volatile, a tiny bit, tiny bit of, of volatiles, mostly NOS, and here's some mostly oxygen, uh, mostly volatiles in there. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to eject the NOS first into the uh, pipe over here by removing this. There we go. And then grabbing some pipe. That's not what we want. Put this here. And we'll take the pipe. What did I say I wanted? I said I wanted the NOS first, right? Yeah, we're going to have the NOS first. Okay. Now, the NOS... Now, this, I should be able to push down the pipe by... Um, deconstructing each one of these segments. And that'll push the pressure up. So we're at... 147. 147. Got to remember 147. Now let's make sure we're at higher than 147. We are, so we're not losing any gas. Let's check the gas one more time. 
Okay, cool. So now we're up to that temperature. How are we going to get it to ambient? I know how we're going to get it to ambient. We are going to steal this. Um, radiator. Because I think there's a place that we can put that radiator on in the outside over there. Oh yeah, and we're like critically low on water. Yeah, we are fucking low. So we're probably going to have to steal water from the plants. And I need to check to see if there is any... Oh, crap. If there's any um, gas trader. Because we need water in the worst way. So, uh... Where is... Oh, it's small. So, L M small on there we go cool okay we can't get this gas trader but we can tell this chem lab guy to get the hell off our pad on our way back in okay Anti and we should critical. we should probably stay in our suits uh, because I have it set to zero degrees, so um, we will thirst less at zero Oxygen degrees. Critical. There we go. We'll close you. And open you. That's not too bad. I could probably even set that as a as the emergency switch by just switching it off. Anything that's attached to, like, D3, if it's switched off, it'll enter emergency mode. Or, like, D2. Uh, one of these Ds, anyways. But not D's nuts, because that's a really old, stupid joke. First, let's see if he's got anything new to sell us. Or water. No. So, um, get off my pad. Okay, so... I should be able to put this right here and warm this, this pipe network up. And it should warm up rather quickly. Okay, it is. And it's already directed outward. Okay. Now, it might be nice if we have some way to do that much betterly. Oh! Oh, yes, we could do it like that. Okay, so... Betterly is a real word. I refuse to... No. We want the one that goes upwards. Like that. Yeah, there we go. Then we'll do this. There we go. Then we will grab our... Duodad. Put the duo dead Light right on. here. Perfect. And that will give us much more better access. Okay, it is now ambient. Good. So we can remove that. Put it aside. Then we'll empty out that network and that will lower the temperature a bit but not as much as if it if it went in there at 20 degrees see 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 we're thinking smart not hard or are we thinking hard smart or are we hardly thinking one of the two anyways 
Okay, so we're down to the last dregs in the pipe network, but we really want to get this as low as possible because even a tiny amount um, can combust. And if we, st if we start combusting too much, well, we might have a chain reaction. I don't think we will because we'll join up the pipe networks and it should instantly fill, but I don't want to risk it. So it's only a few more minutes. Uh, we've got plenty of oxygen on us. Um, we're not thirsting very much, but I am going to have to stay in my suit to keep myself cold so that I, I won't get too thirsty in the interim because... Um, okay, you know what? I'm impatient. I don't want to wait any longer uh, because uh, we really need water. Now, we can steal water from our plants over there because um, the, the gardening isn't, like, super important right now. There we go. So, let's put this like that. And we'll go here and here. And we'll make sure that that's taken. Yes, it has. And it's only slightly hotter than it's supposed to be. And then we'll cut it down to size. Look at the network one more time. And I think that's what it's... I think we're okay. That's, uh... We haven't missed out on anything. Uh... Okay, whatever. There. So I think we're okay. Oh, uh, this is still... I don't know why this is on, but it is. We'll turn these things off. Okay, so we have managed to get to a point where we're okay. Oh, mine right ores might have some, might have some ice on it. Okay, we're going for mine right. Um, no. Let's go 20. What? What's wrong? Nothing's wrong. This isn't on. Okay, this has got to be close enough. Ah, it is. Oh, it's going to take time. Oh, time is something I don't have. Okay, I'm probably going to have to pick these uh, before they start going bad. Because they, they might go bad on the vine. But it could still be okay, I guess. Okay. Um, look away. Look away. I'm going to do something. <sighs> look away. And this has nothing to do with the Stanley Parable. Now, I've been on this... Shh, shh, shh. Okay, this is going to be funny. Trust me, it's going to be funny. <clears throat> so I've been on Venus for a long time. And Command has finally sent me a companion. I would like you to meet Candace. <laughs> Uh, she's been sent here to be uh, my friend and scientific partner on this um, mission. Everybody, I would like you to meet Candace. Candace, everyone. Say hello, Candace. Don't be shy. Candace is a little shy. So, Candace is going to stay with me. 
And, um, yeah, so, um, Candace is very important to me. Stop laughing. Candace is very important to me, so Candace is going to be staying with me. Right here. Candace is going to be right here. All the time. Uh, for the rest of this journey. Okay, Candace. Um, we now have, uh, this, this ore miner, and we're going to call it down, okay? Uh, okay, and I forgot to make switches. Can I make switches in nine minutes? No, I'm not, I'm not going to risk it. Yeah, you're right, Candy. We shouldn't, we shouldn't mess with the, with our survival here. So, we're going to turn vending machine on. And then we're going to turn the landing pad on. Then we're going to switch this back to the small satellite dish. And we're going to land it. Yeah, here comes Candy, don't worry. No, I'm sorry, Candace. Oh, you're right, you're right. You're a professional. I shouldn't call you nicknames. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Candace. I'm sorry. You're right. I will not call you nicknames. You're a professional. You have a degree. Okay, in metallurgy. <laughs> in metallurgy and food preservation. You're at the top of your field. And they chose you to be on this mission because you were... Um, the best candidate for the job, and I'm sorry that I called you by a nickname. I will never do it again. I promise. All right. Okay? Okay, Candace. We'll get that all shut down here. Now, this is quite full. Oh, yeah. It's near explosion levels again. How did it get so much NOS already? Jumping Jesus, man. I don't know how I got so much in there. Okay, well, let's empty that out. So, uh, volatiles is the, uh, the predominant gas that we got in there. So let's... Let's get rid of the volatiles, because... Yeah, we, that has to work. That has to be empty. Uh, well, no, Candace. I'm I'm not exactly sure why I'm not setting up a, a permanent um, filtration here. Um, it could be because I don't want to make something permanent, or uh, I don't want to design something more permanent when it's not really um, what I had in mind. I think I would rather. Uh, stick with these hard to do and fiddly uh, stuff for the time being uh, because it just it just makes me feel better uh, okay so this is unfiltered and that's input okay Uh, yeah, it would probably be much better if I put it if I put something on the uh, on this line here to bring it down. But that would mean that I'd have to run the line, and I can't really do that right now because I don't have um, the things in place to be able to do that. So I'm just going to use this back and forth method for now, just for the time being. Oh, uh, we need to steal the pedestal too. Yeah, I, I could, I could print out a, a pedestal. You're right, I could, but um, I don't have any iron. Actually, I might have iron now. You know? Yeah, I did. I, I grabbed some iron at some point, a little bit. There we go. Now, it is Vol that I want, right? Filter low. Uh, yeah, it is Vol. Thanks. 
and the filter is not completely done right now. Yeah, water is a problem at this point. Okay, yeah, it's going to suck out. I'm also going to empty the X out, so uh, Hydration we, critical. we don't have to worry about that. Uh, we do have to worry about our hydration right now because we are about to empty out our our uh, water tank here. Yep, we're about to empty it out. And that's the last of our water, Candy. I'm sorry, Candace. I'm sorry, I did it again. I know. I know. I I do respect you and, and I'm I do one hundred percent appreciate you being on this mission. I do. You bring a lot to the team. Candace, I just usually call people nicknames. That's it's it's my fault. It's my problem. I will figure out um, a way not to do it again. All right. Critical. And since we're sleeping in our suit right now, we can bring that up to the level. The plants aren't going to care if there's no oxygen. And we're going to buy as much ice as we can from that trader. It doesn't matter um, what it costs. Or anything, because we just need it. Hmm, looks like I never got around to uh, building those large batteries. What's that, Candace? Oh. I should be more professional, right? I'm sorry, Lieutenant Hines. I will call you Lieutenant Hines from now on. And yes, I agree, me carrying you around is undignified. Here, why don't you man the computer? Okay, thank you. You can be in charge of communication from now, Lieutenant Hines. And, uh... I will just continue to vent this here, and that's done. So, I can go out there and find out what the trader um, has. Uh, what's that? Um, no, we can make Constantine now, so we don't really need to buy it. Plus, we can make anything, and I'm going to keep him down here. If he's got no ice, we'll get rid of him, and we will look for somebody um, for a gas trader. But... At the moment, uh, we're okay, Lieutenant. So, can you keep an eye on the plants for me, too? Thank you. And I... No, I still want you with me. My, um... Uh, the, uh... Tablet. I want the tablet with me. You can stay there, Miss Hines. Or, Lieutenant Hines, I'm sorry. Um, are you sure you're going to be okay with this uh, air pressure, Lieutenant? Uh, I can, you know, we we can we can try something else. All, all right, all right, Lieutenant. All right, all right. I'm, I'll, I'll I'll get up in your face, Jesus, Miss Hines, Lieutenant Hines. God, I'm just trying to look out for you. Okay, so we have 19 volatiles. That'll be good for cooling down the base. 
Uh, we have three nitrice. I probably won't go. Water ice, water ice, water ice. Oh, mommy, water ice. Okay, that's it for now. And we'll put this on. Whoops. We'll put this on here. Because that'll warm it up nice and fast. So, the first thing we need is to make an ice crusher to uh, liberate that ice. And I think we're going to move our refill station to beside the hydroponics uh, station. Because we don't seem to be using the airlock to uh, drink anyways. Uh, plus, I'm, I always keep uh, water on me, so it being in there is, is not useful. This is taking a very long time to heat up. We've still got 100 degrees to go. And this has got oxygen in there, so it is, it is going to blow up somewhat. And nitrogen, and nitrous oxide, so that's going to be okay. Now, it's important that we get it up to um, planet ambient temperature so we can squeeze every joule of energy out of, out of what we're um, making. You know what? That's good enough. I'm impatient, and I can turn that off from inside. So we're going to keep it like this. Close you. Okay, so now we need a ice maker. So we will need this to be a little more permanent by not turning immediately. No, we want to turn down like that. Okay. And then if we turn this into a valve, it should decide whether or not it wants to go this way or this way. Hmm. It doesn't matter. And everything is in here, right? Everything's in there. We'll eject everything over here. Perfect. And we will need an ice crusher. And I think we can remove this safely. Yep. And we'll send it out this way with a corner pipe. we get the corner pipe to point the right way. There we go. Now make our ice crusher. Oops, wrong button. Make our ice crusher. Uh, yes, Lieutenant Hines, I'm, I'm making it right now. Uh, no, ma'am, we don't need an extra. There we go. So, do I want to put this right here or over here? I'm going to put this over here because... Actually, over here might be better because we'll have a power supply there. Oh, man. I have to move that out one. Okay. Uh, or I can just connect it right in there. Okay, so let's read the water level on this. Uh, 1.7 megapascals. I just don't want to lose any water while I, while I pick this pedestal up. It should be shoved into this pipe. And it is. Good. So the ice crusher then I'm probably going to put right in front of it right here. Back one. Waste tank caution. So that it can connect up into everything else. There we 
go. Okay, uh, what do I need to finish this off? Filter low. Iron sheets. There we go. And for now, I need one blue pipe, which I have now. What, you can't stack connectors? Ugh, you can't stack connectors. Okay, I don't seem to have any blue pipe. I thought I had one piece of blue pipe. I guess I don't. I need more than one. Um, one, two, three. I need three. Two. Three. I don't need three, I just need two. That's fine. Okay. Now I need to supply it with power. Hey, Lieutenant Hines, I'm going to fill up the uh, ice crusher now with 43 pieces. And that should give us quite a bit of water over here. It has. And I'm going to release the nitrogen into the air, if, uh, if you think that's all right. just uh, through this? Or is it faster to go this way? Mm, it might be cleaner to go this way for now. Yeah, it's probably cleaner to go this way. But I will need a few more pieces of pipe. Uh, why did that temperature go up? news. Okay, so uh, we've crushed the ice. Uh, now we can pull out the nitrous oxide out of here. Uh, I guess that's going there. Uh, oh, first I need to turn off the, uh, the pump outside. That's right. Um, so it should be off now. Yeah, you're right, uh, Lieutenant. It would be nice if we had some cameras outside, but we don't. So we're just going to have to make do. Let's switch on for a second. And we'll see if it's... Uh, if it's been sucked out of this pipe, and it has. That's because I left it on. Okay, there we go. And we will route the rest of it in here. Uh Yeah, I suppose we could we could keep it cycling in the in the main pipe here if we bring this across. And then um, we can bring this down. Uh, but what we could also do is, this is the filtered section, so we could just put oxygen and nitrogen canisters there in the um, in that filter, and then we can keep the rest of it cycling, and they just have an expansion tank. What do you think about that, uh, Lieutenant? Mm, yeah. There would be a problem... Um, with this thing just sitting somewhere doing nothing. But what if we put it back to back onto that one over there? So the uh, 
the uh, two... Uh, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. We put the two filters right here. It'd be a tight squeeze, but I mean, it's already tight in here. Well... Yeah, we'll... Okay, yeah, you're right, you're right. We'll try it. And then we'll see what see what happens. Because, uh, as it stands now, I can put this... Hydration critical. Uh, nitrice in there. And, uh, we can get that going. Oh yeah, we definitely I definitely need to to sort out my my water situation here. Oxygen critical. Uh, no, it's not toxic, so um I, it shouldn't uh, it shouldn't bother me at all. Uh Yeah, I'm just removing it now. Uh, probably just right here, right? That'd be good. Okay. So. Uh, we're going to get that pipe back. Right here. And we'll put that there. And we will go. And make another blue pipe. Just need one this time. Hopefully that's the right one. Yep, there we go. So, I have almost fixed all of our problems. And we need power. And there. Now, unfortunately, the Ice Crusher will only drain when I have it on. So I'm going to have to turn it on and off several times. There. Uh, so. Filtered is on this side. Cool. And is that everything out of there? That's everything out of there. And this should be hot again. Nope, it's still heating up. Why is there X in that pipe? Because I put the wrong thing in there. I put pollutant. <sighs> okay, well, uh, that's going to have to be vented. Okay, well, let's vent that. So we'll wait till that clears. But we'll get rid of this nitrice. There. I'm just clicking it on off again. Oh, look, we have a bunch of of uh, ingots here that I didn't notice that we had. So, uh, we've vented most of the atmosphere out of there. Now we need this, and we're going to switch it back to this, and we're going to switch this to outward mode and on, until we completely bleed out this. That is not the right way. Inward? No, that's the wrong way.
Oh, it can't suck this out. Waste tank caution. Uh, because it's it's set so not to go above uh, 100 kPa. So that won't work. Air tank low. It's just a little bit, so I, I guess that's not going to be a big big deal. Hunger caution. I'm getting all kinds of alarms now, aren't we? So we're gonna go. Cup, Air tank critical. Cup. Uh, we can also remove this. Uh, no, we can't remove that because we don't have enough pressure in there. There. So uh, everything that's left in there is just nos. So we'll pull the nos out. Uh, well, okay, we have to have the NOS in there, because it's on the filtered side. And we've managed to get rid of our X. Okay. And we're hungry. Oxygen critical. Light on. I guess we're onto the pumpkin soup now. Oxygen critical. Uh oh. Light on. There we go. Turn that off. Okay. We are still. Oh, there's the volatile. Okay, so we're still not in a... We're, okay, we're in better shape, but we're not in great shape. Is this up to temperature yet? Not yet, but very soon. And we're going to get rid of this tank now. And, you know, for lack of anything better to do, or a decision being made, we're just going to attach it back to where it was, right here. And then we will decide um, a better solution later. Uh, to inject our hot tank with more stuff. Like that. And then we will put volatiles back on here. And I think that's everything going into this tank now. So we've pushed it down quite a bit. But yeah, a more permanent solution is... Um, is what we need. So that's, that's probably going to include, like, you know, going across here and hooking it up um, on the other side. But we would have to... I don't know what we're going to have to do, because there will be sometimes oxygen in that, in that line, so we don't want to just shove it outside, because that would be problematic for us. Uh, and it can't be exposed because it'll be hot. Okay, let's... Uh... Let's start injecting that, because that's... That's at a temperature that we're fine with. Uh, we have water. These plants are okay. Uh... Uh, how much gold do we have? We have 94 grams of gold, so I am probably going to empty this. Um, 
And we need junction. There we go. Probably going to empty this out into the bottom one. This one out into... No, that one. So, that was the one that we wanted to change. I'm not sure if the valve is going to do it. Um... Yeah, I'm not sure. Well, I'll try to figure out how to do the valves. So, I need the tool upgrade. Tool upgrade, and... I probably don't have enough Constantine. I don't, but I very likely have enough temperature to make Constantine now. So, um, Const, Constantine. Okay, so I need copper and nickel. Unfortunately, I, why was that still on? Waste tank caution. Oh, you can't mess with the waste tank. I forgot to bring out some. I forgot to, to make some. Uh, um... Oh, you're still on. Why are you locked? You shouldn't be locked. Oh, I might have accidentally locked it. That's why you should always turn that off when you're uh, turn the um, the IC off when you're when you're changing attributes, because you sometimes end up doing something stupid like that. But I can take probably. cable from here. And this doesn't need to be on anymore. And unfortunately, I'm probably going to have to like completely fill this tank or completely empty this tank cuz I think you need like 20 millipascals of energy. Okay. Now, all of these sorter cards, 405, look at that, he went up a bit, I guess, I think, I don't know. Scale that back one. Okay, let's see what he has to sell here. Okay, back home. And I don't think my air has recovered at all. No, not at all. Um, I'm not sure that these... Um, Potato plants actually um, get rid of any carbon dioxide uh, when they're like dormant like that. And it's possible that they don't at all. Now, we should have enough for all of the upgrades now. Hopefully. Maybe. Possibly. Okay. And we'll put these back. Perfect. Uh, we also have some volatiles here, so we're going to put the volatile thingy in. Like that. I'll turn this on and we'll vent the volatiles. Yep, there, volatiles are vented. Uh, that should give us a little bit of coolness. 
Yep, 28 degrees. Although we we left our Oh no. We left the um uh, uh we left the um the radiator on outside. And we can't because that'll cool down this thing here. Oh, we got to go back outside. Super. No, uh, we need this. Cool. Gotta come all the way out here just for that. Um, actually, he can get lost now. He's got... We've gotten everything from him that we want. So he can go. Uh, this back on here. There we go. And... No, that's the printer. We need the... The tool mod. There we go. And then after the tool mod, let's get the the um, pipe bender mod. Will we still have enough? Yes! I think we're going to have enough for everything. No, we're going to need more steel. Uh, okay, so is this set to the volume pump still? No, I don't think it's set to the volume pump. And we need to turn that off. Okay, we're at 17. Constantine's got to be at least 20. Eject. Constantine, there we go. Now, before we lose too much uh, heat, we're going to go out there. We're going to turn that pump around. Hopefully, we'll be able to make a turbo pump soon. It's poofy. Oh, and here's the upgrade. And uh, we'll put the rest of the Constantine in there. And we will make the... Oh, we can't. We don't have enough steel. How much iron do we have? We have 123 iron. 40. There we go. And I think I can melt that with just atmospheric gas, is that right? Steel needs 600, but only one megapascal, so no, it needs more than that. But I have the tool mod, so let's put that in there. Perfect. i turn you off for now. Uh, now I should be able to make the big drill. Arc welder. Uh, heavy drill. Is that it? Don't I have the heavy drill? No, I have the Mark II drill. Um, is the heavy drill going to melt? Heavy drill. Oh, I can make it right now. Actually, I shouldn't have done that. Leave that there. There. And make the drill. Haha. -ha. Now, can I make the glasses? Uh, I think they're called lenses. Yep, sensor lenses. Oh man, yes! Waste tank caution. Oh, waste tank, and go shove it. Big Drill, where are you? Hi, Big Drill. Mama loves you. Mama loves you.
Okay, and then the glasses. And I'm I'm guessing I don't make the sensor thing in here. Oh, I do make the processor unit in here. Oh, but I need iron. Oh, the humanity. Oh, the damn it of it all. Um. Can I make a jumpsuit? Hydration critical. I'm gonna make a jumpsuit. Because the military jumpsuit looks nicer, doesn't it? I don't want to wear this this thing anymore. Okay, 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 go, okay, go. Shh. Blink. Ho 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 I'm wearing black. Although I guess I could have spray painted the jumpsuit, right? Light on. Okay, that can get lost. This can go in here, and this can go in here, and this can get lost. Although, I have my suspicions that that, uh, that heavy drill might melt in the, in the heat. Just knowing my luck. Oxygen critical. Okay, what else can I make in here? Lieutenant Hines, can you believe it? I'm eating again. Oxygen critical. Here we go. So, uh, I won't need this splitter for right right now. Now I will need a gas guy. Well, let's look for the gas guy before we go any further. This has been quite a while, and we might end here, because we've gotten a lot done. It doesn't seem like a lot, but a lot has been accomplished. Small dish on. I don't see a small guy. I see a, ba a basics guy, but... We don't need any basics right now. Uh, let's make another chip because we can um, we can put a, an IC in our suit now. No, we can't because I need steel for the other chip. Um, because I can control how much um, how much air I'm giving myself. And it might help, you know, lower my consumption. We're at 33 degrees. Oh, I know what I needed. Oh, but I need steel for that. I was going to put a... Um, radiator on that. But that can wait. We have uh, everything else that we really need at this point. This stuff is going to be sold. Uh, we've upgraded two printers. We have the large heavy mining drill. Uh, we've also got sensor lenses, but we don't have the, the chip for the sensor lenses yet. Um, I'm going to do a batch of steel. There's a little bit of steel in there. Oh, uh, okay, well, uh, we'll do that later. Oh, can I make a bunch of, uh, switches? Because that was the other thing that we wanted to do, right? Oh, logic. Yeah, we can make a bunch of switches. Well, this one will go here. And this one will go right here. And that will control the vending machine and the... Um, the landing pad, and then I might put two here to control that vent out there. So I'll make two more. Okay, so those will control those will control the exhaust vent. Um, 
but we don't have we don't have a turbo turbo uh, pump so putting a turbo pump there I like putting two more switches isn't gonna matter because we still need to go outside and switch it and go outside and switch it and shit like that um, okay uh, what I can do See, the, the problem with that with that vent out there is that it's not going to expel a lot of um, gas once I get it in the tank. Although I suppose I can just drag a little... Eh, I don't know. It doesn't matter. Let's end it here because we've gotten a lot accomplished and I have like uh, quite a bit of footage right now to go through and make a cohesive... Um, thing uh, out of and I, I didn't even get the opportunity to uh, babble much which is what I always want to do Airtag critical. we're hovering around the 33 degree mark but that should go way down once we start uh, mining a whole bunch let's take this off here because we want to connect that um, outside and I want to remember that I want to do that. And we're going to expand this at some point so that I can add more uh, plants onto it. Now, now that I think about it, I should probably harvest those plants right now because they're probably um, taking up water as we speak. So, and I don't think they're giving me any oxygen. And they're not going to decay very fast. I think. I think I have six days to decide what I'm going to do. Nine hours. So we're going to put that there. Uh, no, let's put that there. And I guess we're keeping the get on us right now. Now hopefully, I'll, I'll park myself in here so I know what I want. Uh, the what I know what I want to do the next time we we load up the game. Just settle myself right here and um, then I'll know to turn that around and um, connect that up and put chutes on the other side so that when I'm mining out there I can just shove everything that I find in here and just let it go. And um, I guess that's it. Um, I didn't babble too much today, didn't tell any stories. I was going to talk about the, the my first job, which was uh, working for a vending machine company. Well, not a vending machine company, but a guy that owned vending machines that had them out in the world. And I repaired them. But maybe next time, maybe when I'm mining, because this time we had, like, fiddly shit to do. So, see ya.